Section 4 colon 1 Understanding the Volatility Index, VIX, Strategies for Utilizing the VIX, 4.1 Market Analysis and Timing, the VIX can be a useful tool for market analysis and timing, providing insights into market sentiment, volatility expectations, and potential turning points. Here are some ways the VIX can be utilized for market analysis and timing, market sentiment indicator. The VIX is often referred to as the fear gauge as it reflects market participants' expectations and emotions regarding future market volatility. Elevated VIX levels suggest increased fear and risk aversion, indicating potential market downturns or periods of heightened uncertainty. Conversely, low VIX levels indicate complacency or optimism, signaling potential market stability or even complacency. Monitoring changes in the VIX can provide valuable information about market sentiment, helping investors gauge the overall mood of the market. Volatility regime identification, the VIX can help identify different volatility regimes in the market. By analyzing the VIX trend and comparing it to historical levels, investors can identify periods of high or low volatility. High volatility regimes can be associated with market downturns or heightened uncertainty, while low volatility regimes may indicate periods of market stability or complacency. Understanding the current volatility regime can aid in making informed investment decisions and adjusting risk management strategies accordingly. Market timing and contrarian signals, the VIX can potentially provide contrarian signals for market timing. Extremely high VIX readings may indicate excessive fear and panic in the market, potentially signaling a buying opportunity as markets may have become oversold. Conversely, extremely low VIX readings may suggest complacency and a heightened risk of a market correction or increased volatility potentially signaling a time to be cautious or consider reducing risk exposure. However, it's important to note that using the VIX as a standalone timing tool has limitations, and it should be used in conjunction with other technical and fundamental indicators for a more comprehensive analysis. Risk Management and Hedging The VIX can serve as a tool for risk management and hedging strategies. As the VIX rises, it indicates increasing expected volatility in the market. Investors can use this information to adjust their portfolio allocations, consider adding hedges, or employ volatility-based strategies such as purchasing options or volatility ETFs to protect against potential market downturns or capitalize on increased volatility. Confirmation of market trends. The VIX can be used to confirm market trends and provide additional insight into the strength of a move. In general, Rising VIX levels during a market decline can suggest that the selling pressure is intensifying, potentially signaling a continuation of the downward trend. Conversely, declining VIX levels during a market rally can indicate reduced fear and increased confidence, potentially supporting the sustainability of the upward trend. Monitoring the VIX in conjunction with price movements can provide confirmation or divergence signals for market trends it's important to remember that the VIX is just one tool among many in market analysis and timing. It should be used in conjunction with other indicators, technical analysis, and fundamental research to make well-informed investment decisions. Additionally, the VIX is not foolproof and has its limitations, so it's essential to consider the broader market context and conduct thorough analysis before making investment choices. VIX levels can provide indications of potential market reversals or trends by reflecting changes in market sentiment and expectations regarding future volatility. Here's how VIX levels can be used to gauge potential market reversals or trends, reversal signals. When VIX levels reach extreme highs, it may suggest that fear and uncertainty have peaked in the market. This could indicate a potential reversal or bottoming out of market declines. Extremely high VIX levels are often associated with panic selling and oversold conditions, which could present a buying opportunity for contrarian investors. However, it's important to consider other technical and fundamental indicators alongside VIX levels to validate potential reversals. Trend confirmation VIX levels can be used to confirm or validate market trends. In general, during a downtrend, VIX levels tend to rise as market participants become more fearful and expect increased volatility. 
Rising VIX levels during a market decline can indicate the continuation of the downward trend. Conversely, during an uptrend, declining VIX levels suggest reduced fear and increased confidence, potentially supporting the sustainability of the upward trend. Monitoring VIX levels in conjunction with price movements can provide confirmation or divergence signals for market trends, volatility expansion and contraction. VIX levels can also indicate periods of volatility expansion or contraction. When VIX levels are low, it suggests that market participants expect relatively stable and less volatile market conditions. This may be associated with periods of complacency or a lack of fear in the market. However, a prolonged period of low VIX levels could be a warning sign of potential complacency or underestimation of risk, which may eventually lead to a market reversal or increase in volatility. Conversely, when VIX levels are high, it indicates higher expected volatility and the potential for significant market swings, market turning points. VIX levels can help identify potential market turning points. Sharp increases in VIX levels from a relatively low baseline may indicate a shift in market sentiment, potentially signaling the end of a period of calm and the start of increased volatility or a market correction. Similarly, a significant decline in VIX levels from a high baseline may suggest diminishing fear and the potential for a market recovery or trend continuation. However, it's crucial to validate these turning points with other technical and fundamental analysis. It's important to note that using VIX levels as a standalone indicator for market reversals or trends has limitations. Market analysis requires a comprehensive approach, incorporating other indicators, fundamental analysis, and market context. Additionally, it's essential to consider the specific market dynamics and avoid relying solely on VIX levels as the sole determinant of investment decisions.